This video we're going to talk about Go to the Rock episode 10 Wow <laughs> But anyway guys Keep on watching It's quite an epiphany episode for um, for Particularly for Hitori Our main pro tag But hey guys Let's not get ahead of ourselves right? First order of business The thumbnail Like I said Just A few seconds ago That it's been an epiphany episode for for Hitori or Bochi. This uh, this thumbnail came about when she was watching uh, what's called this Hitori's uh, uh, band. Eh, medyo na manghasha kasi uh, psychedelic rock palang ang genre ng band ng ito. So while she was listening, talagang na breakdown niya yung bawat ay yung individual performance ng bawat member. Was she motivated to um to to, perf to perform well for her own band? Probably, of course. With a with a with a few words of encouragement from Hirui herself after after the performance. Not only this is this scene visually stunning, but the song that was um uh, that was playing, talagang na add up eh, okay? Na add up na na emphasize ang pagiging awestruck ni ni Bochi. Hence the thumbnail. So with that in mind, let's get to the nitty gritty of this episode, guys. Pace! Typical slice of life uh, pacing, right? It's a bit slow, pero uh, medyo bumilis kasi nung ano na, nung uh, what you call this? Nung nagperform ng sikha, yung uh, yung Banda ni Hiroi, right? Medyo hindi naman hindi naman sa naging tense. Medyo pumilis na ponte kasi there's a, well, there's there's rock and roll going on, right? Whole lot of shaking going on in the immortal words of Jerry Lee Lewis. Do I have complaints? No, absolutely not. Remember, guys, it's a slice of life anime. Tapos musical anime pa, so there will be variations in the pacing. Dala ba tumugtog na yung yung kanta na relevant doon sa doon sa eksena especially yung uh, yung psychedelic moment na nangyari kay Enoki Kikitori right but overall guys i got no complaints i'm totally satisfied with the pacing of this episode flow na man first piercing here was when Bochi decided not to submit that form for the cultural festival uh, which actually highlighted the opening scene. For me, guys, that's a no-brainer. Why? It triggered the entire episode. Second gear shift was was when he Hirui visited Starry, of course, in her drunken self. Hey, free boost, the man, Jan. She told her to the manager, "No wait, dumbass." Maraming team leader kasi ang 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 eksena ng ito eh. That's why I call it. That's why I call it the gear shift, guys. Yep, it triggers certain uh, certain key events in an episode. That's what gear shifts do. That's one of the things gear shifts do. Final gear shift is of course the thumbnail, Bochi's psychedelic moment. Again, a no-brainer because why? Well, uh, it's obvious, okay? The main protag is having an epiphany of so no, no, not of sort, but like a definite epiphany because uh, this is the first time she's ever heard uh, psychedelic or also known as acid rock. Right? So, talaga mong medyo Wow! Parang Wow! Cool! Parang gumagano na siya eh. You can also dub this as a, as a character development gear shift for, for Hitori Kasi Na-expose siya tuloy ngayon sa, sa, isa pang, sa isang form of music that she's not totally used to Maybe she can incorporate that into her guitar playing style? Probably Maybe she now has uh, new songwriting ideas based on this, um, based on this performance Pwede rin Alam ko ito mangyari. Total guys, nasa final three episodes sa tayo ng anime na to. It's an all-important gear shift for the main protag in my book. So these three gear shifts that I saw, 
de pitin okay do not watch these uh, these three tier shifts all by themselves right do not be lazy watch the whole episode uh, or you'll or you'll miss out on the music basically and of course uh, the life lessons right you wouldn't you wouldn't get the life lessons if you just watch these three tier shifts plot lines There's the, there are the usual fantasy sequences, all right? With hilarious results, as usual. Therefore, Malinis ang blood, guys. Psychedelic uh, moments and, yeah, basically fantasy sequences um, aren't exactly um, detrimental to a clean plot. They actually help uh, they actually enhance the cleanness of the plot because they're in the same con they're, they fall they still fall under the same continuity but they are showing the viewer what's going on inside a character's mind okay at that moment yeah I'm I totally don't object to um to the to, to watch his fantasy sequences here. Okay? Kasi talagang, uh, talagang, uh, Overworks is actually, what you call this, uh, drilling to our heads na despite her talent as a guitar player, meron pa rin siyang social anxiety issues that she has to deal with every day. Kaya, ang dami niya niniisip. Alright? She, she can be paranoid at times. She's human. Okay? It just goes to show you how human the main protag is. Kaya, very clean ang plot ng episode na to. Right? And those fantasy sequences enhance it. Con kin uh, what's wrong is? Kino-confirm niya ang pagkamalinis ng, ng plot ng episode na to. So, base flow and plot they all came together for this episode, folks. So, Vox in the Rock, episode 10. No brainer. Excuse me. I gotta admit, guys, it's um it's a bit of a challenge to uh to, to review Vox in the Rock. Kasi talagang <clears throat> dinit deep dive ng anime na to ang psyche ng uh, ng main protag. The Hitori psyche is, is center stage on this anime. Okay? Talagang naka-focus sa kanya ang istorya ng anime na to. And of course, uh, she has to deal with the social anxiety issues and uh, some, the, the paranoia that, that sometimes comes with it. You gotta feel for the main character. That's why it's a bit of a challenge. Kasi, uh, so many so many opportunities to deep dive for me uh, I'm a sucker for deep dives okay so kaya in the end talagang hinihimay-himay ko ang ang mga moments na pwedeng i na pwedeng i deep as relatable for the ordinary viewer right but nonetheless Cloverworks has delivered again with, with this episode of Bochy the Rock so, remember, we're on the road to the finale. Final three episodes na. So, uh, dalawang episodes na matatapos ang anime na to. So, let's wait for the next episode. But in the meantime, guys, watch the next review.